Oh, it's been a while since you've been grocery shopping, but you feel like making a quick yummy breakfast and all you have are some almost rotten bananas and a cake mix. Well, you don't need any of the other ingredients in this Duncan Hines cake mix or any cake mix. You can use chocolate cake mix, any cake mix you want, and you could even use up to five bananas. But the more bananas you add, the moister the muffins will be and just... Let's get into it and make some delicious breakfast muffins. I mashed up my banana. I'm just gonna pour in my cake mix. Did you guys know that when you have an overripe banana, like when you eat a banana that's perfectly yellow, it does not have as much antioxidant properties to it than when the banana peel starts to turn black, which is TNF, tumor necrosis factor, I believe it's called. And it is loaded with anti-cancer causing agents, antioxidants, once the banana begins to go black and overripe. So these are actually full of antioxidants. <laughs> That's how I like to look at my delicious cake mix muffin recipe. For those of you who've been watching my channel, you watched us use one of those salad kits to make our street fajitas on the go. And nothing goes to waste in my house. So I do have this cranberry and pumpkin seed pack from the salad that is going to go perfect with my TNF filled banana muffins. And this is gonna be a super quick and easy breakfast. If you find that you do not have enough banana, you could always add a little bit of milk or use less cake mix. It's okay to have some lumps, that's fine. I actually needed a third banana, so I took one out of my freezer because whenever my bananas are starting to go bad, I always put them in the freezer for baking because they are excellent at making muffins. They are so delicious. So first thing I do is I preheat my oven to 350 degrees and these muffins usually take between 15 and 17 minutes. I'm gonna grab some of my cinnamon because I do like to add cinnamon to them. I like to use these silicone baking cups because obviously they're super easy to clean and I'm definitely about that. And I would like to get 12, but I never do. You're supposed to get 12 out of this. I think you're supposed to get 12 if you use four bananas. I found this recipe a million years ago. So I've made it so many times. I just kind of know that I'm not getting 12 because I haven't put enough bananas into it. But um, when you use four bananas and the cake mix, it's about 160 calories per muffin in case anybody out there wants to know. And I do spray my silicone cups because, again, I just want the muffins to come out effortlessly. Okay, so here is our colorful breakfast muffin display. The oven has hit its mark of 355, and we're going in, you guys. And let's see what comes out of this oven 17 minutes later. Most of the time, these come out awesome. I'm not the greatest baker, but I do give it my best. And this is one of the recipes that I do that actually works and is edible. So let's see what we get in 17 minutes. I almost forgot, guys. Once I get all of them in the baking cups, I like to put a little bit of cinnamon sugar on the top of each of them. That's what I have in here, cinnamon sugar, because one, it makes the house smell amazing, like I've been baking for days, and cinnamon sugar always does that, and two, if they come out good, they get like a little cinnamon sugary, yummy crustiness on the top that's really, really yummy. So this is what they look like. See how I love the cinnamon sugar, how it makes the little designs on the top of the muffins? And I poke it with a skewer and it comes out, ah, that, they're done. That, these are definitely cooked. And you could just eat these on the go. It takes so little time to make them. We used up fresh fruit before it went bad. I just love everything about this easy peasy recipe. And if you really want to go for the gusto, you can slather some butter on these. What did you guys have for breakfast today? And would you consider making these in 
an instant. Don't they come out so moist and amazing looking? Look at that. I just love how these muffins come out. They are really moist, delicious, and amazing looking. I love cranberries and nuts, and they're just really filling and delicious. I hope you guys enjoyed this breakfast in a pinch with me, and if you did, please make sure to give a like and subscribe to the channel. And as always, guys, stay safe and stay savvy. Bye-bye.